Today we fix the thing that makes videos feel cheap really quickly. It's audio. Go to the timeline and find your talking clip. Click the audio track so you can see the little volume line. Now play it and look at the meters to the right. For beginners, a good easy rule is your voice should sit around strong and clear without hitting the red. If it's peeking into red, it's too loud. Pull it down. And that is assuming you didn't clip your audio when you were recording it. If that happened, reshoot it. Now drop your music on the track under your voice and press play. If you can't understand your words easily, if it's not clear enough, then the music is too loud. You normally need to lower down the music lower than you thought that you need to. Select the music clip, lower the volume until the voice is always easy to hear. Now click your music clip. At the start and end, you will see little fade handles. Drag them a little so the music fades in and fades out smoothly. Do the same for your voice clips if they pop in too hard. Tiny fades instantly makes your video sound more professional. There's a feature in DaVinci Resolve Studio that does this automatically for you. This is the old way that I did this. When you speak, the music should dip down. When you stop speaking, the music can come up a bit. The easy way on a music clip, enable volume keyframes. You can do it on the clip volume line. Add one keyframe before you talk and one after. Pull the middle section down a little bit. Now your voice stays clear without turning the music off. If your voice has hiss or room noise, go to Fairlight, find a simple noise reduction tool or voice isolation if you use it. Use it lightly because it can sound robotic or underwater really, really quickly. Play the loudest part of your video. Make sure there's no red clipping. Your voice is always clear. If you want a simple target for short content, aim your final loudness roughly around minus 10 to minus 12 LUFS, I will explain to you in a further video. So your homework for today is to set your voice level so it never clips, add music under it, add fades to music start and end, and at least one music clip using keyframes, export a quick test, and only listen to the audio without watching the video. So if you found this video helpful, like and subscribe so you don't miss the next day. See ya.